your username and password, please. I will, don't worry, it's me, Google. You can trust me. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Welcome to another password override tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can use SQL map to perform SQL injection acting like the Google bot. Password override. This project is leveled at easy. One of the first thing you need to know when getting into hacking is to cover your traces and um, that is exactly what we're going to do today. We're going to act like somebody else while performing an SQL injection. So I'm going to use SQL map to act like Googlebot. So the server administrator will think that Googlebot is in, uh, on your website trying to index new pages while uh, it actually is me trying to uh, nuke his website. <laughs> so let's start off by looking at the server log. And uh, I'm just gonna pop open nano here. Password override.com.log and this is the actual server log for passwordoverride.com and uh, what we're going to do today is that we're going to uh, print in the log that Googlebot is on our website trying to index pages uh, but it really is us trying to do an SQL injection so let's go ahead and do that uh, pop on over to our laptop with SQL map on and initiate SQL map. And if you don't know how to run SQL map, you can always go to passwordoverride.com for a great tutorial on that. So, www.passwordoverride.com slash index index.php dbs. And this is a normal uh, SQL map command. And uh, what I'm going to do now is that I'm going to add some information to SQL map, making SQL map act like the Google bot. And this is done by typing tag tag user tag agent equals, and I'm going to paste in the rest of the command. And as you can see, it says user agent Mozilla 5.0 compatible Google bot 2.1, and then the address to the official Google bot webpage. So, Let's go ahead and initiate SQL map and see what we've got on the server. So as you can see, the actual attack is already going on. So we can already go into the server log and uh, look at what the last lines in the log says. So let's open up Nano once again. And scroll down to the bottom. And if we follow these lines to the right, We'll soon see. <laughs> waiting, waiting, <laughs> waiting. And here we go. Mozilla 5.0 compatible Googlebot 2.1 HTTP www.google.com bot. And this is the ex exact text that you would normally get in your server log if Googlebot was on your server trying to index new pages. So if you want to fool system administrators, uh, that the Googlebot is on their website trying to index pages while you are actually trying to perform a uh, hacking... Uh, hacking... You're trying to hack your server, goddammit! This is an awesome, uh, awesome technique that you could use uh, together with SQL Map to act like Googlebot. Hey, it's you again!